you've not seen the forum. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I put Major Notes on it. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you then? What's the name on there? Mine, Tapout King. Oh, yeah. oh right. Peg Levy. Yeah. You're who, sorry? Peg Levy. Oh, yeah. Well, you must not see, but I got me picture. I'm Tartofsky. I, spent, I literally spent like two thirds of my day at work. <laughs> <laughs> That's all anyone does at work, isn't it? <laughs> I, I, get get out. Out. I work as a sales manager out on the road a lot, and, you know, in the office, and my boss is about. I haven't got one that works for me, so I spend all day. So you're Tchaikovsky? Tartofsky, yeah. <laughs> tap out king. Tap out king with 1980. Is that because you tap out a lot or because yeah, you tap other people out? Tap out a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I wish people would just put their real names on there, you can see who it is. It's more fun trying to find out who it is, isn't it? To be fair, more people know me as Tartofsky than they know me as my actual name, so <laughs> it's just easier, isn't it? There's one up there, I can't even know, Stalko or Stalko or whatever, I don't know that Stalker Chews, Ollie. Who is, who is, um, is it? Yeah, that's Ollie's Stalker Chews. Right. Who the hell is that um, Welsh Brin that everyone takes a kiss at and keeps getting into trouble with it? Big br- Fat Bride? Yeah. Who's that? He's not here, he don't come here. I feel quite sorry for him in the end. No, he brings everything on himself. He swaps clubs and swaps training classes. That's all. No loyalty then? No loyalty or service. And when he does, he slides <laughs> everybody off the glass club. Always going on about how he wants to be a blue belt. Well, he is a blue belt now, actually, but wanted to be a blue belt, wanted to fight this, wanted to fight is that. Is he a but decent never belt, or is he Standard most of the people here, maybe they generally be mostly white belt standards. Uh, we've had Chris, who's a blue belt, myself, blue belt, Brad, who's like over there, I think. Brad on there, eh? Yeah, Brad in the white shorts, he's another blue belt. My daughter, Emma, we're the only blue belts in our club, the rest are all white. Who, who won the female? So I was changing there. Because a lot of these guys hit the Emma doesn't do no V, but. That's her excuse. So say, that's my excuse as well. It's a good excuse. Guys here that I see, so I've, I've, I've imagined a lot, of, especially the sort of bit really big up built ones. They seem to be MMA guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you've got a few MMA fights. Which you can't really sort of say, you know, you're a blue belt or whatever. Stand. It's more like, yeah, I've been training MMA for six years, and it's okay. We train both anyway. Yeah, so we, we, we're we're Randy at the moment. We just do straight BJJ. But you don't think Ken's open? Then? I will be. Yeah. Not to bother you, is it? No, we got stop overnight. We are. But so now Where is it in Ken? Stopping overnight. Some tre- premier in. Somewhere in Ashford. Yeah. So the nice thing is, we're at the moment Andy trains in, say, trains over in Guildford. I live towards a walk shot way, and he's moving to Farnborough. So the new academy is going to be 2.3 miles to Guildford. Game. We're training, <laughs> <laughs> training every day. <laughs> mm. Right, Nigel Larry's up because he's fighting on here in a minute. He's fighting there now. He's on here in a minute. <laughs> I don't know, I don't watch the fights. I'm too busy with the paperwork. That's a bit naive. Under 78. The guy who got gold. Not either of us, mate. No, oh, no, I just got. Well, I just got owned by the big guy. Actually, <laughs> 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 